there's a new screening test to assess a woman's risk for developing breast cancer. Similar to a pap smear, it is being hailed the pap test for the breast. ABC 23's Aaron Briscoe is in Southwest Bakersfield today to see how the halo works. Aaron? Emily, the HALO breast pap test is fairly new to Kern County. And while mammograms are recommended for women 40 and older, the HALO is designated for women 25 and older. Since statistics show breast cancer as being the leading cause of cancer death in women 20 to 59, doctors are hoping the new screening method will be a breakthrough in treating breast cancer. For Tina Griffin, breast cancer has always been a concern of hers. Her mother was diagnosed with cancer at the young age of 38, just one year older than Griffin is right now. I started having mammograms at 35, and um, it's always something that's kind of in the back of your mind. And when my mom was diagnosed, they said that she had had it for about eight years. The problem with a mammogram is usually something's been probably in the breast for eight to ten years before it actually is seen on a mammogram. So the whole goal of this is that we can detect something early. The five-minute test has been described as a feeling similar to using a breast pump. First, a suction cup is attached to the breast. Then, using heat massage, the device tries to draw out secretions. If there is secretions, a sample is sent to the lab where they detect if there are normal cells or atypical cells. The whole goal of the test is if there's atypical cells present, you can monitor that patient more closely with the goal of detecting the breast cancer at an earlier stage. Statistics are alarming. One in eight women will develop breast cancer in her lifetime. Seventy percent of women diagnosed have no identifiable risk factors, and eight in nine women have no family history. But for Griffin, who does have a family history, she is not willing to take any chances. I'm going to have it done once a year, just like a mammogram. Anything that can detect breast cancer in its earliest form, you know, I think that's a wonderful thing. San Dimas Medical Group, which is next to Mercy Southwest Hospital, is the only facility in Kern County to offer this test as of right now. Now, the test is usually given annually, and it costs about $100. Live in studio, Aaron Briscoe, ABC 23. All right, well, worth the price.